first time I come across Keeney was actually when he wasn't with United, when he was at Notts Forest, and we were playing, playing them in a League Cup final at Wembley. And I remember um, it was early on in the game, and I had the ball, and I think I just checked inside, and Keeney just took my legs from under me. He swore at me, I said something, and I just thought, who's this idiot here? I've had so many arguments, Rocky. I probably have one every day. <laughs> I remember one game at Coventry when, you know, he squared up to me, and that was over me not crossing the ball first time. If you do something wrong, you know Keane is the first person to tell you, and uh, some people find that harsh, but, you know, none of us do. I'm sure I can be a pain in the backside to play with, but hopefully at the end of the day, when I train with the lads, I have arguments or discussions, whatever, hopefully they know, and I think they do with my teammates, because people think I'm always giving them a stick, and, but I, I do, I love my teammates, I do. Well, it is fierce, and it is personal like, when you're on the pitch, because he, he means it, and you mean whatever you're saying back. But I think it helps you both concentrate on the game, and especially if you're in opposition, and you see two players going at each other, teammates like that, I think you think, oh, these are my business, the, the, the winners. There are moments when you, you just think to yourself, wish he'd, you know, go away, and you, but, the question is, I mean, people, you, you, do you want him in your team on a Saturday afternoon? And the answer is always yes. They definitely do struggle, especially the foreigners. You know, you think, oh, he's a mean, uh, hard, tough player, uh, tackles, uh, you know, you see the sending off, you see him uh, screaming to the referee to opponents to colleagues and you think all right well, you know what what is that all about you start to realize what it what it's about he, he just wants to improve the other player he wants to win that's that's one thing about Roy you know he wants to win games he doesn't care you know about anything else that's going on around him once he steps over that white line of the pitch then that's all he thinks about doing I think it is his job as captain to get the best out of the team, get the best out of the individuals, and um, I think he does that. <laughs>